Okay, so uh, this is like a well, it's gonna be like a couple, it's like a chapter. So right now, uh, it's April, well Thursday, which I have a class in the morning. My DIY class, and you see the date and the time. Uh, so that way you can see it clearly. Uh, So, you know, uh, like I said, I can't, okay, so I'm saying, so I'm going to say in chapters or, uh, probably just comes to write, just like, uh, it's one three in the morning, so I already signed a contract with, uh, Uncle Ray's, and he's the only one he has, you know, permission or authorization, you know, uh, to sign in my behalf. I give him the consent, uh, just him, nobody else, and Austin Roses is, like, doing this, like, fake editing, uh, Basically, like, uh, basically, they want to uh, kind of like a like a, a studio gangster. They want to see their heart, is there this and that. So they're editing it at their own way. So they're cutting, you know, my words and putting something worse that they're not. So uh, he's like the definition of a studio gangster, though, because like they whatever technology they're using, you know, <clears throat> uh, he's behind the mic, and that's like the studio gangsters. Him, uh. So Oscar Rosas is the Ranco Negro, you know, uh, uh, he thinks that, uh, and leader of the GBGs, gay boy gangsters. Okay, so Jose Romero, Jose Miguel Romero, that's the older brother, that's a super cholo. Because, like, uh, supposedly he's a South Sider. Oh, but let's get back to Oscar. So, a little bit of brother, uh, you know, a little bit of uh, uh, background about Oscar. So Oscar, okay, so basically he was like a a, a Southsider <clears throat> in middle school. When he went to, uh, you can say you can do a background check on him. You can go to and like I said, everything I mentioned, do a background check and and it's true. Whatever I say is, uh, do a background check and and you will verify that it's true. Okay, so Oscar Roses supposedly he started hanging out with Southsiders and became a Southsider, or supposedly you know. Just to me, he's still okay. Well, anyways, supposedly, okay, so supposedly, and all the words that I'm saying or whatever, or he's like, you know, uh, secretly recording. Yeah, I'm gonna, <clears throat> let me just get recording. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna put everything in one page. So, uh, I'm gonna say just technology or whatever, because software or whatever they're using, I don't know. And it's, so, they're using this uh, high tech device. Let's put it that way. So, like, right now it's one three in the morning. I want to go to sleep. I was working. And because of them, I almost got fired again. And Oscar is like Captain Saberho that he was talking shit about Super Cholo, uh, another one of the big gangsters. Uh, so he was bitching about him or bitching about me because my ex-wife left me. And so he knew my situation. So he still always talks shit about my ex-wife. Even though, like uh, like I said, I'm going to go in chapters and put everything on Instagram. I want to get it covered because they're doing this. Uh, and and Oscar is like the mother of his child, uh, partner. That thing is trying to like uh, be something that she's not. Like I said, she doesn't even have a high school diploma. Uh, like uh, like she, I mean, she has like hey, the only thing has like a uh, medical assistant. And at the same time, like I said, I I respect people or whatever. But to her, like at her level, to be a medical assistant. And try to, or like record my my conversations, and change them in their own ways or, or format it differently with different names or whatever, because like uh, like I said uh, you know because like I went to college or or were simple like I mean, uh, uh, I mean I was okay so, you know okay my mistakes are my mistakes whatever, and like I said that's the thing that Oscar wants to find out like my life in the pen and and and. He's trying to like use this to, you know, use it as as his personal, you know, his personal benefit. Like uh, for example, like uh, <clears throat> I've been talking to people, and people didn't know me. Like I said, uh, you know, and like I said, uh, it took me. And like I said, it's just like to him. Okay, so all those three. Okay, so Sergio Romero, uh, the child molester, because Oscar, my brother, he lets Sergio, Sergio Romero. 
uh, which is like I said, do a background check. Like I said, uh, do a background check. Uh, Sergio, okay, so a little bit. Oscar Rosas, uh, he's always been a thief, you know, uh, a wankster. Uh, Super Cholo, Jose Miguel Romero, the older brother, uh, he testified on on the murder in Gilroy that uh, he had a, uh, an attorney uh, named Duarte and it was here in San Jose. So, so he uh, he testified against his friend, I mean, his friend. So, uh, you know, he, he was uh, uh, extorted in, in, in county jail, I mean, uh, not in juvenile hall, juvenile hall. So he was extorted in juvenile hall. So uh, he's, uh, he's with this, like I said, like uh, the two, uh, my other brothers. So Super Cholo, Jose Miguel Romero, testified at his, at his friend, Marcos Valdez. And, and the murder was like Carlos Vaca. So uh, he did some juvenile time and he got extorted because like uh, he, uh, my dad paid him an attorney. So he went to court and testified against his uh, supposed uh, gang, uh, uh, H Street, a uh, self -sider. So since then, uh, a little bit about him. Uh, he uh, so he got he took somebody's purse, and I mean a female's purse. So at the bar, so that boyfriend found out, and well he got punched. I mean it's true because like why would you take, uh, you know especially like I said things that I condone and things that I don't condone. So I was just using this and to uh, oh by the way uh, so as like I said uh. I, 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 um, I'm blessed because I did my, my, uh, uh, actually a friend of mine, uh, he blessed me and he started doing the, um, the Real Kebab Productions Inc. race, uh, you know, already right serve. So, and the reason we started doing actually I'm blessed today because like he has all rights and everything and whatever, like I said, uh, I'm doing this on the page, whatever you guys found, I mean, everything is true that I will never, ever give him no consent. So if you find things that on his behalf, Oscar or anybody related to to the family, like my mom, my dad, or whatever, uh, anybody to my nephews or whatever, uh, my uncles, I never sign and I will never, ever sign anything. The reason is because Oscar has always been a thief and people that know me from 20 something years. Uh, you can call Leonard Redu. Uh, he works, uh, he's a TSU counselor. Uh, he used to work at Momentum, uh, at Momentum uh, Bill Wilson, uh, TSU House. So he's a counselor. So, you know, he does a TSU and, and housing and counseling for youngsters. So, uh, let me do, uh, I mean, we have, like, minor setbacks. And like I said, uh, I have, like, no hard feelings towards him. And he knew about my brothers. Like, they, they were trying to kill me. And they were setting me up and all that stuff for years. So, uh, something happens to me, call Leonard at 408-608-5884. Uh, so, he lives at uh, 383 Curry Drive, San Jose, California. He's like the only yellow house. Like I said, I mean, uh, if you look at the house, I kind of like date like they were myself and everything. But because of like, you know, small things, uh, you know, we had a man who said back. But I mean, I have no feelings or like negative towards him. You know, towards him. I mean, God bless him because like, uh, he knows since like all my brothers... And like he knows that uh, they're clowns, and and he's seen a lot of things, and he knows a lot of things that that uh basically every, they stole from me, and and uh, they were forced like signatures from me, and they were because uh, due to my divorce, and Oscar's like always been a thief, uh, oh, but anyways, so so uh, Jose Miguel Romero, uh, so he t he testified against uh you know what let me put uh I gotta put some music and show my my. My company because like uh, these clowns they have like okay so everything that I'm saying okay so they're changing it or editing it at their own way which I will never give them authorization and I'll tell you a couple reasons why but let me uh, let me put my my company uh, actually the real kebab okay so so I'm gonna do so on, on this page that I'm gonna make uh, I would put something else because like they, they uh, like I said, they hurt in my ears and, and it's one in the morning and I have like, got 10 class and like I said, they're doing all this because like they want to see me suffer. Like I said, <clears throat> they want to steal from me and Oscar Rosas, uh, they were for 386. Uh, he, uh, so this is some, uh, pastor died. Okay. So anyway, so Oscar Rosas find out uh, and he did a background check with, uh, he did a, a back okay, so he's doing a background check. I mean, I, the whole reason of the background check, 
is because he sees me riding a bike. And okay, so after riding the bike, uh, the thing is like I mean I was like I was fit. I mean when I got out of prison, and the thing is like I was starting a company, but now it's just like a the Real Kebab Production Inc. started, and that was how it's based on. And and everything's based on because like uh, like I said, uh, things happened in my life that also did their background check on me and, and things like that. Uh, hold on, hold on.